Hi everyone, it's me, 16mm DJ. Um, I'm just going to do a quickie here. Um, this is uh, another video, of course, about my Commodore 64 setup. Um, there's a problem with the fuse down in the, down in the uh, kitchen, and it's messing with our lights here in my room, so the light switch doesn't work. But um, I'll try to do it in here so the image quality might be a little bit grainy. But here, let me this will probably make it re recalculate stuff. It's even worse. Um, I'm just gonna open both these things up. Okay, that's a bit better. So I'm gonna go ahead and sh turn everything on here. Uh, uh computer's on. And just a few seconds, there we go. And disk drive goes on. This video is basically gonna be about how my uh, how my 1541 is now completely working. I've basically fixed all the bugs, I think. Um, the bugs were me being stupid. I was typing in the wrong things. Um, it mostly it was comma 8, comma 1, and comma 8, mixing those two up, doing wrong things with them. And now basically all my programs and things are working. So I'll just do a quick little thing with this uh, various programs from this cassette tape. Uh, that one, I think. Sorry. That one, I think. Um, I'll just load something off that. I'm not sure what it is, but... Um, here, I'll do some quick disk, disk operations. So I'm going to type load. I'm going to do, do this. And this is going to give me a directory to the drive. Oops, messed up. Comma 8. And when you're doing a uh, directory listing, you don't, want, you don't want comma 8, comma 1. You want just comma 8. Now, searching for money. Loading. Ready. I'm going to go ahead and type list. And that'll give me a quick list of the directory... And a quick directory of the drive. So as you can see, I got a whole bunch of programs here um, that I made and I took out of the back of the book. Um, here's one piano keyboard. I'm gonna go ahead and load that one. I'm gonna type it. Give me a second. Ah, oh, what is this? Uh, load piano keyboard. Comma eight, comma one. And so when you're doing programs like this, you do need comma eight, comma one. When you're loading a program from disk, you need comma eight, comma one, which I did not know. So it makes me stupid again. So I'm going to go ahead and press enter. I'm going to try to keep this short because last time I really went over my time. I, I did it. This is my second round of this uh, video. So here's run. There's the piano keyboard. And so there, the audio just came on. And I can change the waveform or the octaves. As you can see, and I can also change the waveform. <coughs> that, of course, is just noise. But uh, I'm going to run stop restore this real quick. So they're ready. I'm going to type new to clear the uh, RAM. And I'm going to go ahead and load. What's the next thing I have here? Um, the great thing about having this disk drive working is now I can use um, all my. Uh, what was I going to say? Commercial programs. So I have this. This is called the Video Wizard. And um, let me load this in here. Some of these disks do give me trouble because um, I think probably because they're slowly becoming corrupted. Uh, here's a case for the Video Wizard. It basically is a titler and a database. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and type load, comma, 8 and get a directory so I can see. Because sometimes these things just have little issues when I'm supposed to start it the way. Uh, list that the instructions want me to, and sometimes it just don't want to work. So I think it says load vw, load vw, comma eight comma one. Do that. Searching for vw, loading and ready. And I'm gonna go ahead and type run, run copyright notice, uh, 1986 by Intracorp Incorporated, uh, all rights reserved version 1.2. So this is gonna take a while.
I still got half my time done, and stuff takes so long with this darn machine. Uh, oh, that's a weird noise. Beep. Should be just about finished here. I hope. If not, I'll have to... Oh, there we go. So, this is basically just the main menu for the video wizard. Last time I tried this, it did some weird stuff. It didn't like to, um... It didn't, uh, it didn't go to the right directories correctly, and, uh, it didn't go to the right, like, if I press F5, it wouldn't go exactly to the program. What I have to do is I have to run Stop Restore, or I guess in this case I have to reset it. And, um, and, uh, so I just exited it. Um, I have to actually look at the directory listing that I had open earlier, and, um, choose the program out of that. Oh my god, look at the moon! Wow, I'm so distracted so easily. I don't know if you can see that. Look at it, it's so pretty. That's so nice. I love living in the city, man. Anyway, back to the topic we were on. Um, okay, that's it. that's all I have to show you with the video wizard. That program's kind of cool because you can um, do uh, titling and stuff for VHS tapes. Here's another one. This is Family Tree, and it just puts together a family tree from um, from uh, facts that you put into it. And I'll probably just load it up real quick so you can see the... Um, um, and you, oopsie, oh, I didn't spell, put this down, I do this, uh, well, I, I don't like the keyboard on this computer, M-E, M-E-N-U, there we go, that was difficult, comma 8, comma 1, searching for menu, here we go, oh, and that goes to menu 1, um, this is a one-step software, we strongly suggest that you make a backup copy of this diskette for everyday use. <coughs> Please store the original in a safe place. Green Valley Publishing Incorporated. And we get this lovely little border to show up. And Green Valley Publishing. Welcome to Family Tree, a tool to trace your family history. And I can do this, and it loads stuff. And this, I'm, I only got three minutes left. Um, I should probably be kind of fast with this, shouldn't I? Um... Loading, 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 loading. Wow, this is taking a long time. I might just exit out of this as soon as I can, just so I can show you the last thing. Finish loading, please. Wow. Uh, it's taking a lot longer than I remember it. I hope it hasn't frozen. Oh my god, I only have two minutes left to have. There we go. Family tree. Uh, you can't see that, can you? Um, new tree. It just has all these options. You can make a family tree and stuff. I'm going to quit and um, exit out. Uh, I think I'm just going to run Stop Restore. That tends to work sometimes. There we go. New. Since I'm being quick, there's supposed to be a super fancy way you need to get out. It tells you to go buy more Target products and stuff. Um, last thing I'm going to show you is a picture. I originally loaded this onto a tape from the program Gang Ed. And, um... Load. Wow. I cannot... I'm sorry, I need to put this down again. I cannot type without... Okay, so I'm going to just get a directory again. List. Uh, pictures. I'm going to go ahead and type in this one. Load. And, uh... Oh, one. Searching for Pander. Loading. Let's take a few minutes. Oh my god, on my last minute. Come on, be done. Man, time flies when you're watching videos, doesn't it? Or at least when I'm making videos, because I'm insane. Okay. Run. There we go, panda bear. In my last couple seconds, I want to tell Mr. Ver Mr. Senor Verde that this is for him. Um, color adjust, yay. 